It says that it produces 50 at a time. And they each require... Like... Oh, it produces 120... Cubic meters of water per minute. And they each require... 45, I think. Require 40. So. Try to get the grid back on. What do you mean a gravity issue? Now we can check the full water supply. Refilling again. Okay, so what happened? What happened? Filling up with water. You're filling up with water. You're filling up with water. Okay. So this one just didn't have enough water. Once it hit zero, it now. What if I flush it? What does flushing do? I assume that that's bad, flushing the water. I think we're I think we're in a better spot now. Let me just check all my coal generators. That's at max. That's at max. It's filling up. Okay. And then how much uh, how much play do we have left on the uh, entire network? Not a ton. Are you guys having to burn? Not great. I would rather not have to burn biofuel. I can make another coal production and still be okay if I need to. Certainly have enough water at this point. Hello. I think I would like to. I think I'm going to. Yeah, I, I might as well. And we can, since I'm not using the fuel anyway, I can just route this to uh, a production over here. So what we're going to do is we're going to build um, a kind of landing spot for it. Now if I want to build coal production, I need some reinforcements. Each one's using 15 per minute. I'm bringing over right now 60 per minute. As soon as I update all of the conveyor belts, it'll be double that, 120 per minute. But we also have like insane amounts of spare coal right now. We've been not using all of it for a long time. Uh, also, I never finished making this. I need to make that because I need to reinforce steel. Higher numbers. Grab you. Maybe we can do that. I think we're probably fine on the grid right now. Let me just check a power pole. I mean, it's 
It's close. It's close. What are you making? You're making for iron as well? Going into this thing? Going to feed... Um... And also... We need screws. So, uh, for screws, how many screws do we need? We need 60 screws per minute. That's just two. Two of these? You might even, like, be really close to being that. How much is going through here right now? 80? Do we have any spare screws anywhere? Hey, hold on. How much are we sending... How much are we sending the assembler over here? Has no spare capacity. Screws are going crazy. You are at. Are you? You are using a hundred per minute. You are getting a hundred and twenty per minute. We literally can't give you more screws. I can't separate them though. The objective is to build the most efficient factory. Right now, it's like pure chaos. Um, okay, so if we build... Wait, are you just not powered yet? Build a power pole over here. We're gonna need one anyway. Any of these have any spare? Oh, you. Dude. Go. Power pole built. And can power this. We're going to make. Oops. Iron plate. So we're going to get massive iron plate production run. Then, we need screws. So, screws. We're going to go... One. Two. Oh. Are all of you at 100% right now? Where are you making? You're at 100%. You're at 100%. Where are you even going to? This one is going to nothing. This one feeding all this stuff. You are going all the way to that one. So it's just this one doesn't have anywhere that it's going. In that case, let's build another one of these. Airlift. That. Going to build a 
gonna build from here. build a splitter over here. Now, if these are both going to do iron rods, they can only use 15 per... Just put a splitter right in the middle. Also really low, by the way. Woo! Splitter. So... You splitter you there valid shape crap all right again put her back Okay. Good stuff. Ironing, iron rods, iron. Then, you guys, we're going to go straight in. Forge can. About right here. We're going to do a merge. That. Perfect. Air. Air. We're going to. This. And I think I'm dangerously close to overpowering the grid. Getting close. It's getting close. Whew. Yeah, I also want to see the new Thor movie. I have not had a chance so far. But soon. Rector. And we're just going to do two, because we only need to get... A splitter. We're going to need to build a better one out because we need to get. Oh no no! Here we're good. Here. That into there. That. You guys are going. Cruise. Forty. Forty. I think you can only handle so many at a time. How many can you handle at a time? You can only handle 60. We're going to have even more extra. So, build another storage container here. And, like, just face it that way. Put in a merger. There. At. At. Have you out? Er. Build you to that. Per okay. And then go back. Boom. Okay, so we're there. We're just missing the power. This is going to be scary as hell. But we're going to then power these all and should be ludicrous. Please, game, do not blow up the power grid quite yet. Or if you do, I guess it's not the end of the world. But it would be nice if you didn't. You're feeding this. Okay. And you should have now more plates. Okay. 
Yeah, I know. I know that's how you do the overclocking. Um, I'll get. I'll. Oh, that's right. You could. You could underclock. That's true. I haven't thought about that. I could underclock some of them, but I feel like I don't need to do that yet. All right, I need another power plant up here. Um, old generator. Oh, this. Add you red somehow. There. And. Two. And. There. And get another water. Function. Like. Right there. Right. That. Right. That. Right. Looks super jank, but that's how we're gonna go. Excellent! Whew. Success! And our capacity increases yet again. We no longer have to rely on these biofuel. Okay! Crushing it. Rid of that. I don't know what we're gonna do there yet. How much of this do we have? We have 59. Let's go see how this production is working now that we uh, built all this up. Should be good. That's going to almost triple, maybe even triple our total production. You don't get any screw. What? Why are you not getting any screw? I asked you to have screwed. Oh, I didn't connect this here. <laughs> oh, also, this actually needs to be upgraded. Uh, second belt. Any screw. And same with it. Also need those. Holy crap. Now you should be filling up with screw. Love it. Okay. Whew. Still cutting out for you? What's cutting out? In general, audio's cutting out, or specifically, my voice is cutting out? My voice is it still cutting out super weird how about now is it any better now I increased uh, a little bit the volume so that it catches it and doesn't cut out is it too loud now Do I need to turn down the volume of my voice? <laughs> I jumped real hard there. Sorry about that. Okay. Well, I didn't get the copper really yet. I also don't have the steel production I need. Um, let's start making our own plates while we're waiting. You jumped hard. <laughs> Sorry about that.
It should be good now. I can also turn down a little bit uh, of that, but... Woke up the entire building. <laughs> Alright, we have 61. I'd rather... I, I need to get, like, at least 200 before I can go back. Otherwise, it'd be shameful. Uh, with two assemblers running at full blast, we should be pretty close. And we are, like, utilizing iron. It's not super efficient. I can definitely improve. 30 iron plates per minute. How much are we producing of iron plates per minute? 20 and also oh, we're doing 40. Okay, I get it. Eventually the screws are also going to back up a bit. Once we cap it out at 100 or 200. Thirteen. Seven. Not really there yet. But I can make my own. Let's go grab, um... Let's go grab some of these. Let's go grab... Where are... These? And let's go make a whole bunch of uh, reinforced steel plates, how about? Geronimo! And then we'll go finish our coal, and then next time we can do steel. Uh, copper right now... We're not really using a lot of copper. Um, what do we need here? We need... I don't even know what these are. Can I make these things? Hopefully I can. I also might need more coal production before I can radically expand what I'm making. We get a gel bounce plate. Would be pretty fun. That's true. Okay. Um, so I'm assuming these things need steel beams and steel pipes. I also think I might have enough of the copper stuff that I may never need to do anything with copper again for a long time. I kind of went overkill with uh, making sure that everything was like crazy efficient. I uh, made way more things than I actually need, apart from the things that I really need, which is reinforced iron plates, which I need way too much of right now. What are we at? 140 something? I don't want to have to go get another coal plant. Well, I mean, I, I can get... So if I just double up, I can get one more coal plant and still have lots of coal left over for steel. Okay, we've got... Probably still not enough, but we could con we can continue building things out from here. Um, what do I need to make? The steel beam requires steel ingots. Plus four steel ingots to make a steel beam and steel pipes. Steel requires three and three. Let's go see what is a furnace, uh, how much can a furnace output? Oh, I, wait, I can't even make copper ingots. Why can't I make copper ingots? Oh, I need a foundry. Okay, hold on. Let's just build this here for now, just so I understand. Understand for later. 
what this is going to require. So, a foundry can do steel. And it can do 45 and 45 at a time. That's actually a lot. I'll be able to make like three steel ingots 45 per minute. That's not a ton. And then I assume we still just use constructors to make the steel stuff. So then if I, I just want to see what this takes. So to make us, we'd make steel pipes. This can use 60 steel per minute. Holy crap. That one only uses 30. That's more reasonable. I think I have to overclock my steel and have it do basically an extra 50% because it's going to be hard for me to be able to supply enough. Are these irons? Is this coming in? How much are we pumping at a time? This is definitely 120 at a time. We're pumping 240 iron. And we are using thirty, sixty, ninety, one twenty, thirty, sixty, ninety, one twenty. Okay, holy crap. All right, so what if I build, uh, let's, let's get rid of you. What if I build an assembler? I want to see what I need for some of these things. So for a versatile framework, I need 12. What the hell? I need 12 of them. That's insanity. 12. Steel beams, I can make it 15 per minute. Oh my god. Which is producing- that's- and that's if I have more steel than I'm actually generating out of one of these foundries. Oh my god. We're gonna have to get more iron from somewhere, and we're gonna have to get more coal. Oh boy. I have not started a spreadsheet yet, but... What is this last thing? I don't even know what this is. What is what is this? How do I make it? I've not seen anything that can make that. Do I have to make that myself? Automated wiring. How do I make automated wiring? I've unlocked all these things. Oh wait, I've unlocked this phase? Improved melee combat, that sounds good. Hypertubes, logistics. Okay. Damn, let's go grab some of the stuff. We gotta get coal going. That's the number one thing we need right now. I didn't realize we were already unlocking the next tier. So, while iron is done for now, we're gonna need to get another iron mine. And then after we get the uh, other iron mine, we're gonna have to go buck wild on coal as well. We're gonna have to get a second coal, second iron mine. We're gonna have to go on another adventure, guys. Another coal adventure. Now, the second coal is actually closer. It's just up at the top of the mountain. But it's that way. So we'll use this coal here purely for coal production or uh, coal power. We'll use the coal that's over here. So it's like clear off in the distance that way. We'll use that coal this one for uh, for our steel production. 
I do logistics for my day job, yeah. The Great Coal Odyssey shall continue. The important thing is that we got this thing ironed out. Also, I need to research the whatever I have stuff. Okay, so there was one part up here where uh, we hadn't upgraded it yet. So let's start with this. This is already level two. There's one up here though that is not level two yet. Okay, so all of this up to here is now level two. Very important. Next, we gotta get this. Boom, boom. Double lifts. Double check, that one's good. That one's good. The next one, now good. Yeah, I need to make a separate uh, hot bar. There we go. Let's do all the, uh, this is down here. One, two, three, four, uh, five, six, seven, eight. This is gonna be our conveyor stuff. I think this one's already at level two. Am I, I am neither. I, uh, I do supply chain uh, tech. I manage all of the software or yeah, platforms that we use to make all of our supply chain decisions. Huge emphasis right now on, like, planning systems. I don't think so. I think I just built them hugging. Oh, you mean in-game? I don't know what that means. For your belts? Okay, so we need six more there. We have a lot more belt to cover here, but we're getting close. I don't think there's a tiny conveyor between them. I'm pretty sure that I just did one to one to one to one all the way up. I've not load balanced. What do you mean load balanced? Oh crap, I'm gonna die. I did not die. I don't know what that means. A central bus that feeds all of your production. Oh, make belts go in such a way that they're splitting out, spitting out of splitters at different rates. No, I haven't done that. Now, eventually you can. You can get smart, smart ones that know how much it needs to feed, right? So it'll only send out however much that one needs. When you're doing splitters and when you're doing stuff like that. They don't actually do that? What do they do? Do smart splitters like just know what parts to send out each side? 
Or is it, but it doesn't change the rates that they send them out? So you're talking about doing splitters and then combining, then splitters, then combining until you get exactly the rates that you want, right? Yeah, that's super awkward. I think eventually I'll have to do that. My plan, well, not my plan, but very likely we're going to have an entire floor that is literally just that, but... I'm not going to worry about that for now. That's going to make more sense once I'm using overclocking and underclocking to get like ideal production. Like, I don't know. We'll figure that out later. Why am I over here? Oh, I'm getting more uh, reinforced steel plating. How much did we make? 35. I feel like I make it faster than the machines do. I don't know how I feel about that. Okay. I'm going to start going from here backwards. This will now inform me if I have any uh, spots that I missed. It should leave gaps. Right? Like, this should be pumping faster. Unless, of course, I'm already at capacity in the storage unit. Which is also very possible. I'm at capacity in the storage unit. Okay, so what we're going to do then is uh, just to be extra safe here, let's stack them. I feel like this is one area where it's like really good to have spares. We're going to go logistics. Oh, wait, we need a MK2, right? Okay, MK2. That. We're going to actually eliminate this. Build another MK2 here. Then we're going to have you go from here up to there. Okay, so we should find gaps if there are any uh, where this is moving faster. Okay, that should get that up. Are we good? Are we all at 120? Nope, we're not quite there. Got to be very close, though. Ah, uh, not quite there. How much do you need? 22? This is an MK2 belt, though. What are you? Okay, that is a level two. That's a level two up there too. Two. We're good. So it's literally just this one, one, two strip. These two and then we're done. So what we should see here is Now, this is interesting. Yeah, we should see gaps like this. Spaces between. Because it's delivering at twice the speed. 
Okay, that's good. And then this should be filling up from the bottom up. That one's full. That one's getting there. And then what we're going to need to do is put in... Um, you know what we're going to do? We're going to come over, split here. Make a splitter here, and then go back in. And then we can split towards this way and make even more coal. We're gonna need more water as well. Oh my gosh. We're gonna go full production next time or full power next time. We're gonna get all the coal power that we can get. And then the last uh, thing we'll do after we get all the coal power where we wanna get it will be to get another coal over here so we can make steel. So, let's grab, quickly make some more. I think we needed roughly 40 reinforced plates. We can just make those ourselves. No, it makes sense, because overclocking power means you need less facilities to generate the same amount of power. Um, so, like, I totally get it. I just don't need to worry about it right now. Space is not a problem. If space were a problem and we had finite supplies, I think I would overclock sooner. But right now, space is not a problem, and overclocking them will not reduce the amount of resources that I need anyway. So I'd rather just build everything, and then I can overclock later if I need to. And what I would end up doing is overclocking in, like, sequence. So you overclock at the beginning to produce more coal. Then you have to have better conveyor belts to get the coal over here faster. Then you overclock all the production so that it can use the more coal. So there's like a whole chain there that I'd have to do. Um, so it's easier for me to just focus on right now, use the space because I, I don't have any space problems at all. Um, and then, uh, sort it out later, basically, if I need to overclock. Okay, so we can now... This is all in MK2 already. The first one that's not. And the second one that's not. And now we should be theoretically maxed all the way down the line. So we see this is the last this is the remnants of the halves. And they are being filled, so we are good. We are actually pumping 120 coal per minute from our spot. Okay, fantastic. Do I have more hands now? I have a third hand. I guess we can put the chainsaw on this in there for now. That's cool. I can look up stuff, too. Very cool. Alright, but for now, I'm gonna end. We got our coal, even more coal. Um, we got more water. We upped our efficiency up top. Now using all of our iron. We started making copper sheets. Uh, leveled up to the next tier. Oh, we're getting there. We're gonna have to redo this entire main floor next time. And we're gonna have to get access to the next coal plant. Should be fun times. But for now, this has been Nate. 
Uh, thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you next time. See you later.